Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I am here with a collab video and I love doing collabs and this is a face-off collab with two of my very close friends here on YouTube and this face-off concept is created by Daniel Schmidt and I am doing this with Debbie and with Annette and we have done one of these before, <laughs> I can leave it up here. We did a face-off collab with the Magic palette from Juve's Place. Today we are using two palettes actually from... I think we all love this brand so so much. It is Shroud and we are using both the Creepy Cute and the Arcana palette. And we are using three shades from this and two shades from this. And if you have seen our first collab Debbie and I, we didn't trust Annette with picking the colors, so I was the one <laughs> that uh, randomized these, these five colors. So, yeah, I'm going to swatch them for you. So, from the Creepy Cute palette, we got, of course, the boring grey one. <laughs> so, we got Tom, Tom Stone and also... Uh, cold shoulder this blue one and from the arcana palette we got familiar shroud and darkling okay so i think i know what i want to do and i will start with darkling and should i tell you what i want to do i'm gonna do a halo eye it's just my thing i try to have it as my thing but I'm not that good at halo eyes but I'm trying to so I start with darkling and okay Annette and Debbie I talk about them like they are I don't know um I have followed Annette for like Two years I think and it was through Annette that I got to know Debbie and it was uh, with the collab we did like a year ago and I am so happy about that and I think like YouTube is amazing in that way okay do I really want to do this so okay I got to know Debbie through Annette and I can't concentrate. <laughs> I'm so happy that I got to know that I know both Annette and Debbie. I consider them as my friends. And okay, I'm going to take Darkwing. No. Okay, I'm just going to continue like this. We will see how this goes. And I, if you like what I put up, and you're going to love what they are putting up. They are both color lovers and both of them has a really unique and cool style. And I just think it's so fun. I don't know what I think it's so fun. I actually don't know what's up with me. I'm trying to do a halo and I'm trying to like have a conversation with you at the same time and tell you things. It's hard. But I think you should really check them out. But it feels like the most of you that are watching me are watching them. So yeah. But if you don't, do it. So I don't feel like every time I do a collab it feels like I want to... Uh, do like a presentation on the people that I'm doing the collab with but at the same time it feels strange to do it because it feels like everybody know who they are and it just feels like if you're following me you're probably following them as well and I will of course leave <laughs> both of their channels down in the description and also up in the card so after you have seen my messy halo, as I think it will turn out to be today, go and check them out. And what I love about these face-off collabs 
I didn't even tell you what it was. We are doing a look with the same sh shades, shadows. And it's so fun to see what other people will do. I don't think that anybody of them will do a halo because it feels more like my thing. It would be so fun if I was wrong and we all three did a halo. And are they even today? No, they are not. But now I'm going in with this familiar in, in the halo and I really hope that this will work. And I think it does. I was most happy about this shade, I think, because it was like... If you haven't seen our first face-off, we got six shimmer shades. Six shimmer shades. And it was like, what the hell should we do with this? But when... Because it was me that picked the color for this. And... Uh, when it started out, I think I got this shimmer shade as the last shade and I was like, are we going to do a whole matte look? And no, at least one shimmer. It feels like a pretty brick Raylo. Sometimes it's like my head stopped working or my mouth isn't working together with my brain. Okay, this is like really, really big halo, but that's what you get on my channel. I think I like it though. Okay, I don't think I want to mess this up even more, so I will just have it like this. I will take away my fallout, fix my base and my brows, and then we do the under eyes, and I have three shades left so I have shroud and the two from creepy cute so thumbstone and cold shoulder and I just have to figuring something out with this why did I do a halo I have no idea I will fix this it will be somewhat okay I hope Okay, so now we just have to try to make this a look and I actually like don't know Can we just skip a color maybe? No, we cannot So shroud a bluish Gray kind of thing Thumbstone a gray kind of thing <laughs> and then cold shoulder a pastel blue Why did I do a halo eye? I don't know. But here we are. And what to do? It feels like I have collected myself a little bit. I'm so sorry about all the things. Okay, I think I will start with the gray one from Creepy Cute. Thumbstone. Thumbstone. I think that is like the hardest thing with speaking English for me. Seems hard. Thumbstone. Thumbs. We don't have that like in Swedish. Thumbstone. Thumbstone. We don't have that. Why do I think like this is language class? We have like you that I sounds that I think it's pretty like just a sweet. Can I just shut up? Okay, I think I will take the gray and just try to smoke it out. I'm so unsure on this. I'm gonna tap this brush off really, really much because I don't want this to fall. Well, it feels like this is pretty dark. I want this to be a liar gray. <laughs> it feels like it's getting kind of messy down here. 
But it feels like I always feel like that. And then I look like at the video and I was like, I could have dragged it down even more. Okay, and now I'll go into Arcana and Shroud. And I'm trying to, I don't know if this will show up, but like take it out here and I don't think it will make any difference. I think a little bit. Okay, I don't know if it made any difference, but it's there, so I have used it. It feels like it's too much and too dark, but I think I need to put on like mascara and something in my waterline. So, okay, for the last one, I go in with the, the Creepy Cute and I poked my face. <laughs> Cold shoulder, this one, and I will take this. In my inner corner, as an inner corner shade. Maybe this is what fucks everything up? Or no. Just like that. I will put on something in my waterline. I think I will take a blue, like to connect it with a cold shoulder. Put on mascara, try to choose a little bit. Oh, it's so hard for me. And then I come back with the finished look. So this is the finished look. For my waterline, I used prawns from Colourpop. And for my lips, I used Brucey from Colourpop. That was Sapphire and Igard and um, Colourpop collab. And I... I don't know. I actually don't know. I don't know about the lips. I took a red lipstick first and tried to take it away because it didn't look good. I don't know if this looks better, but it feels like it suits the eyes a little bit better than red. So yeah, this is my face off collab look with the creepy cute and the arcana from Shroud. And it has been so fun to do a collab again and it has been so fun to do it with Annette and Debbie. I think we should do this like yearly. <laughs> so yeah, if you haven't checked out Annette or Debbie, you should really do it. You are missing out if you don't because they are so amazing, both of them. And yeah. I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!